Hello and welcome through to my um, short review, well more of an information, on Harman Kardon's new wireless HD audio system. It's called the Omni system and what you can see in front of you here is the Omni 20, which is the large guy, and the Omni 10, which is the small guy. This is the back of the Omni 10. If I flip it around you can get that view. So they, they kind of look identical except one's a little bit larger. So for the details on it, the Omni 10 is a 2x25 watt by amp speaker. So that's this one there, the small one. And the Omni 20 is a 4x15 watt by amp speaker. Um, the system itself, um, fantastic. Um, if I give you some views around it, so on the back you can see you've got a nice flexi base there which, which really handles the pace well. On the bottom of it, you've got your power input and you've got your WPS to set up your Wi-Fi if you want to make life easy for yourself and you've got a reset button and you've got an audio in in case you do want to play audio straight direct to the speaker you can do that um, it's got a nice rubber foot on here will say though if you've got really bassy music these things do tend to wander a little bit so my ones at the moment are kind of pinned down a little bit so they don't go strolling across the, the surface so the whole purpose of these right so these are a complete wireless system in the same vein that you'd find from Sonus. Um, for me, I started looking around for a wireless system for the house because I've always had amp and speaker setups and I just wanted something a bit cleaner to place around the house rather than having the speakers all over the place and amps and whatnot. Now, don't be um, confused here. These are not going to compete with your Morgan Schultz Denon amp setups or your Baron Walking setups or, or your Amplin Gallows or any of that stuff. You know, I've run most of that stuff over the past and they are better. You know, the bottom line is amp and speakers are always going to be better than any of these other systems that you see on the market. It's as simple as that. They, they just are. They're, they're better sound quality, they're put together better, they, you know, they're for audio files, they're for people who really know what, what sound is and stuff. These things are not, they, these are really for your everyday household with screaming kids running around so you can put some music on to drown them out. Um, the clever thing about this system is it's all wireless and it works on, on your Wi-Fi network, similar to Sonos. The only thing I'd say is that these are better than Sonos. Sonos from my point of view, for someone who's listened to a lot of different speaker and amp combinations, I've always found Sonos quite tinny. I, I wasn't blown away when they came out. I've listened to them in different guises, in you know, in all the different versions they bring out of the Sonos, and I've never been blown away by them. Harman Kardon's Omni system is definitely got a lot more depth in sound. It's definitely bassier, and it definitely pumps out more volume. The way it sounds like it, you know, it, it, even even if the, the wattage on the speakers is better on Sonos, for some reason these things just sound rounder and truer and smoother. And they really come to life if you've got multiple ones of these throughout the house. So for me, I've got four throughout the house. I've got a couple upstairs and a few down here. Um, I've only got one twenty because I wanted one focal speaker and I wanted loads of small ones around the house. Um, the sound quality is excellent on it, really is good. The only thing that I found when I was looking for the wireless systems, the only other thing that came close was Denon's offering, which is really good. And if anything, you know, it's on par with the Harman Kardon, but from my point of view, I like the look of the Harman more. It blended in with my house better. And like I said, this isn't really about an audio file. It's not about people who are banging to speakers because that's not what these systems are about. These systems just offer great sound quality from small packages. The clever thing about the Harman system is it comes with its own app. Um, the app itself, you can download it to your Android system, you can download it to your iPad, your iPod, or you know, whatever you're running at the moment. And the system itself basically catalogues all of the music in your iTunes library on the phone. I want to make that clear, on the phone, the music on the phone. That's the stuff that you're going to be listening to. Anything you've stored on your phone from your iTunes library, the Harman Kardon app will pick that up and you can play it to these speakers. Now the clever thing about these speakers, they have a system on them called Follow Me. So that's what this button in the center kind of does. So the way it works is, on the app you can pick which room you want to play your music to. So for me I've got living room, kitchen, bedroom one, bedroom two, etc, etc. So if I'm playing music in the kitchen for instance, I would shoot the song, drag and drop the song onto the speaker in the kitchen via the app. 
Then when I leave the room and go into the living room, all I have to do is touch the button on the top of the speaker in the living room and whatever's playing in the kitchen will follow through to the living room and upstairs and wherever else I want to go. Just walk into a room and touch the top of the speaker, this button here, and it will follow, it will follow you. The music will follow you to the room you're in. And it works well, it works really well. Again, this is all dependent on your Wi-Fi network. The Wi-Fi network within your house is the thing that's gonna make these things work or make them not work, for instance. So for me, my house is quite long. If I have a speaker down the far end of the house, my Wi-Fi doesn't reach it. Now you can get extenders, etc., etc. I'm well aware of that. I'm not that bothered, so I've just moved the speaker more into the Wi-Fi range. But if you don't have a decent Wi-Fi coverage throughout, it, throughout your house, none of these speaker systems that work on the Wi-Fi will really operate that well, to be fair. So that is important. But other than that, the system itself, the follow me system that these speakers offer is really, really good. It's just a really clever idea. And it's easy to use. My wife, who hates technology, has embraced these things. And she's got the app on her phone and she can use it easily. She's learned how to make up playlists on the app. Um, obviously, the, the app itself will suck in your iTunes playlist. So if you have a play, playlist on iTunes, it will do that. Now, the negative thing, the thing that I hate most about this system, iTunes on your PC will not connect to these. Now, for me, that was kind of crazy. If you've got a lot of music, and obviously most people have got a lot of music, and you, you, you wouldn't have it all on your device all the time. You might have it on your PC all the time. So you want to play direct from your iTunes library on the PC. Well, you can't. These things will not connect to iTunes. I don't know if it's something that Harman's working on to sort out, but they don't connect. So you can't play music direct from your PC to these. You do need to use the app on the device, like an Android device or an iOS device. Works fine with that, no problem. You can shoot music over to it on the Bluetooth. So if you connect your phone via the Bluetooth button here, like you would any other Bluetooth product, and you start playing music on this speaker, and then you walk out of the room, when the music's still playing on this speaker and you want it on this speaker, same thing, just press the button on the top and it will do the same as it will on the Wi-Fi network on the Bluetooth network. So you can still shoot music from one to the other. Um, so the prices on these things. The Omnia 20, which is the largest one they offer, this one at present is 249.99p. The Omnia 10, these are going for 159.99p. Now I got mine direct from Harman and I got them a lot cheaper. Harman are doing refurbished um, speakers, which is what these are, but obviously coming direct from Harman, they come with a lifetime guarantee and you know, they, they give you a lot of help to be honest. They always did before, I, I've had amps from them before and they've always been helpful with anything that's gone wrong with my amps. Um, I picked these up for 169 for the 20, from, direct from Harman that is, yeah, 169.99, and this was 99.99 direct from Harman. So you can make a massive saving if you want to go and use the refurb stuff that they sell on their website. And you're going to get the same cover you would as buying brand new. And they came sealed in their boxes and whatnot. So from what I understand, they're just returns from stores or whatnot. I, I don't know, but either way, either way, they've been great. I've got them throughout the house and they sound brilliant. I'll go back to what I said earlier on, don't be getting any of these wireless systems, whether it be Sonos, the Denon system, this system, whatever you're looking at, if you're into amps and speakers and that's your thing and you like pure sound quality and you like really heavy bass, these systems are never going to deliver that. That's not what they're about. They're about a small speaker system that you can put around your house and it's discreet and blends in and gives out nice sound quality. That's what these do and they do it well. Love the Harman Carbons offering in, in, in my mind. If you are looking into Sonus and you really like Sonus, try these out before you actually go and spend your money on Sonus. I guarantee you will buy these over Sonus. They just are better sound quality. Take it from someone who's listened to a lot of different speakers over the years. I love these things. I think they're great. You know, As far as a, a Wi-Fi network speaker, they are absolutely brilliant. And yeah, I've been, I've been really happy with them. Um, yeah. Um, feel free to stick any comments you want in the bottom there, and any questions, just just uh, shoot them over and I'll try and get back to you with any answers you want to know. But yeah, these are Harman Kardon's Omni System Wi-Fi speaker setup, HD audio, which obviously is apparently better than CD quality. I'm never going to use that because I use iTunes, so most of my music comes straight through iTunes and I'm, I'm not looking for that sort of clarity from the music I'm listening to, but they've made it future proof for things to come, which is 
which is always a good thing because obviously things move along fast in technology so they've covered that off which is a good thing which is good definitely but yeah I, I highly recommend them yeah thanks very much for listening to my short overview I wouldn't really call it a review but it'll give you an idea what they're like because most of the other reviews at the moment on, I, on iTunes are on, iTunes, on YouTube are pretty much uh, in different languages which is kind of annoying if you're trying to find a bit of information out about them yeah any questions feel free just to put a comment in and I'll try and get back to you and answer them thank you very much for watching my overview